Hello, and welcome to another Cyborg Plague video. I thought I'd take the time to, um, show you something that was really cool. Um, it's called, uh, Keeper FX. It's a Dungeon Keeper mod. Basically, it allows, <clears throat> from what my understanding is that it's kind of a rebuilt of the game. From, not, not from scratch, but... I don't even know. You'll have to go to the website. I'll leave it down in the description. All I know is that it allows you to run Dungeon Keeper, the original, on your computer, no problem. No slowdown, nothing. And it fixes a lot of bugs, and um, it takes advantage of uh, a lot of new things. Um, you, you, Of course, you need the original Dungeon Keeper ISO, but other than that, it's very easy. And I'm going to show you that. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's do that. So first, um, you of course have to have the original dungeon keep. Uh, excuse me, dungeon keeper, which is right here, which is cool. Then you want to download the um, the dungeon keeper, the complete. Um, Let's go there. The complete version. Decompress it and put it in a folder. I just put it in this folder right here. And then all you, from there all you gotta do is go to the launcher. Go to the readme. Read it if you want to. But I'll tell you the basics. So You click the installation button to point to where your files are. Then you click OK. From there you can start the game, or you can go to settings and um, set up your resolution and all that good stuff. Even 1920 by 1080, but I don't recommend that because then um, all it does is really stretch the screen. It doesn't, um, like other games, it doesn't really um, affect it much. But I do recommend 1080, I mean 1024 by 768. That seems to work great for me. And then point of sensitivity and censored ship. Uh, which was only originally in German. So from there all you got to do is start the game. And this is where I'm going to show you some gameplay footage. Um, so at this time I forgot to set bandit cam to, to mic. Because I'm not, uh, not used to it. So I'm using bandit cam to record which I don't normally do, but for some reason it was much smoother and uh, nicer than Fraps. Um, at least for this game, normally I use flat Fraps, so I'm just showing you some gameplay footage. Um, I'm telling you that I'm planning to do a playthrough of Dungeon Keeper, since I've never played it before. And uh, that's about it. <laughs> 